Tonight, Moon and planet Jupiter are very close together. Probably around uh, yeah, six degrees away in the sky, of course. The Moon is in a crescent form, as you can see here. Okay, I'm using two telescopes, two refractors. This one is a Prince Optics uh, model 660. 76.2 millimeter almost three inch a little bit bigger and this is the skull watcher edat uh, which is a, a shot glass upper chromatic telescope this is a long telescope with the f of the i think is f18 or something like that f17 or 18. Uh, the focal length is 1250 millimeters and I'm looking at the target which is a planet Jupiter uh, with the EDH millimeter and on this one because the field of view is really bigger with the uh, Wix NSLV 5 millimeter and I can say that the image on the Jupiter is similar there is no difference between the two I cannot see any difference between the image quality of this Uh, on the axis of course if it goes a little bit off axis this one you will see slight chromatic aberration not much and with this one you don't see even that so which one I recommend okay uh, this one if you find it it worth if you get it uh, cheap it's really re difficult to get it but sometimes you find it second hand this one readily available you can get it anytime anywhere so both of these telescopes are equal to me the only thing is that because the f number of this one is almost uh, three times the f of this one f ratio that means that uh, the image in this is bigger field of view in this one is wider quite wider so practically you will have a wide field without chromatic aberration and a slightly smaller field not a slightly practically more smaller field of view and uh, without chromatic aberration again so these two telescopes you just make your choice which where is available which one i prefer i cannot say this one is easier to target of course this one is slightly difficult but not that much both of them are good refractors the similarities between the aperture uh, is very close just uh, probably 3.8 millimeter uh, the difference between these two and I, I can say that I didn't see any difference on the moon on the Jupiter with them on the moon I will show you how it looks like and you see a bigger moon and on the moon with this one you see a smaller moon details are less visible so which one I prefer for the moon this one definitely with this one you have to use a bigger uh, um, um, smaller focal length and bigger magnification with this one just to see the same size image of the moon as this one
course this is the objective lens of the Skywatcher ED-AT as you can see it's relatively very good baffled everything dark inside, the lens is clean this is the inside of the lens of the um, Prince Optics model 660 and as you can see the lens has some uh, slight fogging on it is because of the shorter dew shield and uh, you can see that there is a finger mark that's mine probably and is some of the chipping of the paint inside I cannot see any baffles but it's very long this is a uh, of course uh, the objective lens of this three inch and uh, yeah as you can see no coating